Holy crap, guys, I am so excited right now. I have been looking in every store for this girl. All right, guys, today we are in Macon, Georgia, and this must just be how they do malls in Georgia. It's like a complete outdoor mall. There's the spirit down this way. And it's just like what you would find at an indoor mall, directory and everything. We got everything you would see at an indoor mall, but it's all outdoors, including things like this. A small child balancing on a wood. <laughs> I'm not even kidding, it's pretty cool out here. Look, they got Great American Cookies, they got Buckle. There's even a Hot Topic back here. But where we are going today is this store right here, Spirit Halloween. And you know what's funny? This one is also in an old Charming Charlie, just like the other outdoor mall in Georgia we just visited. Ooh, there's a men's warehouse right next door. I need to go see if I can find some fat guy clothes for the wedding. Anyways, here's the Spirit of Halloween right here in Macon, Georgia. We are gonna go in and see what kind of awesomeness we can find. I believe this is store number 56, guys. Number 56, out of 100 stores. Stick around because I might be coming to your store next. Anyways, I'm excited. Let's go in and see what kind of awesomeness they have. Making Georgia, Spirit Halloween, non-automatic doors. And look who we have right up front. It is Mr. Monty. Hello, Monty. Let's see if we can get him going here. All right, Monty's going, but I don't hear anything and I don't see the yellow eyes, the Scott Farkas yellow eyes. That would be a Christmas story reference. Whoa, right off the bat. Let's start right over here, guys, with this whole stack of animatronics. Okay, so we have, as usual, a whole ton of jumping spiders. We have two tombstones of terror. We have an Annabelle here right in front of Monty and a Nozzles. We also have a gigantic, no, we have two gigantic possessed pumpkins. And look on top, we have two Sam Groundbreakers. Feels like a, wow, that's a hard head you got there, Sam. We got a bag of bones. We got a crimson, creepy crimson girl on a swing. We got a giant deadly creeper and two nozzles the clowns right at the end. And look, we have yet another possessed pumpkin on the other side here. We have plenty of bubbles of death tubes here, but these spots are pretty empty right now. The Spirit Halloween movie. Guys, I cannot wait. I am so excited and I cannot believe I got to film in the store where this movie was filmed. All right, let's take a walk back through the store here and see what else they just might have in stock back here. Well, I do see more jumping spiders. There's always a ton of those. We have some Pennywise side steppers here. Oh, and there's a skull hiding behind this one. Hello, Mr. Hand Skull. Holy crap, guys, I am so excited right now. I have been looking in every store for this girl, Little Miss Throwing a Fit. She is coming home with me today. Look, her real name is Mischievous Mandy, but to us in the know, she's Little Miss Throwing a Fit. All right, I'm adopting you today, but I gotta say hello to your friends. Hello, mister. Hello, mister. Hello, mister. Hello, mister. Hello, mister. <laughs> we got some awesome creepy dolls here. We have Hugs the Clown. We have Nestor back here and another Hugs. We have Decrepit Donna and Eerie Emma. Wait, let's get a good look at Decrepit Donna. Look at that face and Eerie Emma. We never really take the time to look at them. We have the Vintage Clown doll, the Creepy Cracked Head doll. Oh, and behind them all, we have a Vintage Wolfman doll. They have all the awesome plush. Man, I just love coming in here and looking at all these things. I've seen them a hundred times, but I love them so much. We have both of the Sam plushes with the burlap head and the spooky pumpkin head. We have both Skelly Bones and Crouchy. Oh, Crouchy's stuck on something back here. Hold on, there he is. There, look at Crouchy's face. We have this guy, and then we have Barbara, and we have Adam. We have some Sam, oh, wow, we have one, two, three, four, five, six Sam sidesteppers here. Some more Pennywise sidesteppers. 
We have the Bi Sai Triclops skull. Wait a minute, let's go over on the other side here for a minute and see if they have any other animatronics because I totally forgot I was looking once I found Little Miss throwing a fit. Okay, I do not see any more animatronics, but I do see the Halloween Ends mask. We're seeing these in just about all the stores now. Wow. This is usually how I find them, guys, like smashed up and stuff. I had to try to puff them out. But this one actually looks really good, and I haven't even touched it at all. How much is that anyway? $79.99 for the Halloween Ends mask. Wow. I still haven't really decided what I want to do with the masks in my office, but I kind of want to get in Halloween 1 and the Halloween Ends mask. Just to have those two, the beginning and the end. But I truly don't believe that this is going to be the very last Michael Myers movie. Those movies make way too much money for them to stop making them. They quit now, it would be none for you. Excuse me, can you please stop poking me? Okay, let's take a look at the inflatables that they have over here. It looks like it's pretty much everything that we've seen in other stores except for, look at this, guys. I think I've only seen these in one other store, the six-foot inflatable skeleton hands. And I like Fright in the Box so much that every time I see him, I think, oh, I want to buy him, even though I've already bought him. These hands are really cool, but I just don't think I want them. I always have to look for the cats, and they do have the creeping cat, but not the secret keeping cat. I will tell you this, though. Every time I see this guy, I want him more. Monkey bone skeleton. Oh, here's the live wires. I couldn't find them in the other store when I was talking about them, but they have them here. They are $50 each. Wow, that's more than I expected. I thought it was going to be like 20 bucks. 50 bucks to electrocute your face. Uh-oh, okay, if I don't do it, someone will tell me I forgot. Hello, rat. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're gonna have to operate, ma'am. It appears you have a serious case of throat eyes. All right, let's venture over here and see what they have. Oh, wait, they have the spiky and the slim sidesteppers. Let's see if we can get these guys going. Yes. I've seen him in a couple stores and he wasn't working. Same with Slim. Please wear, yes, there he goes. Pretty cool. Wow, he just keeps on going. <laughs> I just wonder if they'll ever come out with spiky and slim animatronics like they have Shorty. It would be kind of unfair if they didn't let you complete your collection. They don't even have a Shorty sidestepper either. All right, let's keep moving. Ooh, I do like this if you wanted to dress up like my chemical romance. And they do have a small selection of Scream stuff here. I don't see the blue or the purples or the reds, but they do have the chrome. That's totally awesome. Man, I gotta be careful. I'm seeing a lot of stuff I want and I feel like spending money today. I could really get a good collection going if I would just spend some time in this department right now. All right, I think I'm just gonna stick with Little Miss throwing a fit. Okay, this is funny. I looked at the Stay Puffed Trick or Treat bag before, but I didn't realize the hand is a Stay Puffed Marshmallow hand. Whoa, look how tiny this ghost face mask is. This is a kid's size ghost face mask, but it's almost as small as that dog costume. <laughs> All right, guys, that's it for Macon, Georgia. I'm so excited. I finally got Little Miss throwing a fit and I held off from buying anything else, even though I wanted to buy every single thing that I saw in the store. Mm -hmm.